Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be this natural glam. Well, natural, there ain't nothing really natural about this beat. But um, it's kind of a natural vibe. Not too much going on on the eyes, just a bit of glitter and lashes. And also, um, pour up in lip gloss. Um, if you guys haven't tried lip gloss in a long time, you better try it because I'm loving it right now. And also, just subtle highlight and bold brows. And um, a lot of bronze, not much contour. So, I hope you guys enjoy this look. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did. This is perfect for you guys that are going back to school or just want an everyday kind of glam. Or if you just want to watch me be my face, then that's okay too. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. So starting with a clean moisturized and primed face, we're gonna be getting our beat on. So the first product is gonna be the L'Oreal True Match Foundation in Cappuccino. These are the new foundations that have a lot of color range and I'm really, really loving it. It's probably like my favorite ever foundation I've ever tried. There's so much pigment, so much coverage and oh, I just love the feel of it. It's um, my go-to at the moment so definitely give that a go if you haven't already so I'm just going to be blending that throughout my whole face and then moving on to my concealers I always mix concealer because it just depends how bright I want my under eye to be popping that day I'm using the shade toffee and and fawn mix that together and just blending it out under my eyes, on my chin, and on my forehead. And then blending that out with a damp beauty blender. I find that this makes you look awake and bright eyed and ready for the day. So this is the kind of look that I'm going for today. So then I'm using my Laura Mercier translucent powder. You guys already know, this is my holy grail. This is my ride or die. So I'm putting this under my eyes and everywhere that I put that concealer just to make sure that it stays put and it doesn't move and it doesn't crease. And then I add a little bit more concealer on the bridge of my nose just for definition. Blended that out also with my damp beauty blender. So to reverse that Casper the friendly ghost look going on right now, I'm using this black opal finishing powder because ain't nobody got time to be looking ashy right now. I'm gonna put the shade down below, but this is so amazing, guys. It's it's so inexpensive and. I'm just obsessed with it right now. It gives me that bronzy look that I'm just obsessed with right now. You can tell that. No, this is not a sponsorship. But I wish Black Opal, if you're watching this, where you at, boo. But um, I'm just in lich. I'm just in love. I also go in with the same powder, just in the crease. This is for when I'm going for a quite natural look, just to give me some definition in my crease. And also on the bridge of my nose for when I'm not going for a harsh contour, just, you know, a natural, um, I woke up like this kind of look. And then I'm using my large fan brush to brush away that finishing powder. And then I go in a little bit with a bit more contour, just lightly in the hollows of my cheek. As you can see, I'm not using too much product. I'm just going for that natural look. Now just blending out with a small dome brush, just making sure there's no harsh lines. And then going in with the same sleek highlight and contour kit 
with the shimmer powder and putting that on my eyelids it gives a really subtle glow as you can see now it's all my eyes and then I'm putting a little bit of eyeliner just in my tight line I also find this makes my eyes look a little bit more awake as well and then I'm going to be using these lashes that I bought from Amazon. I'm going to put the link below. I really, really love them. And they're quite natural looking. They're really wispy, so perfect for that natural glam look. And then I'm using my telescopic, L'Oreal Telescopic Concealer on my bottom lashes to open up my eyes further. And then using the same sleek contour and highlight kit to just to brighten up my cheekbones yes glow baby glow come through glow and then I'm using my finishing spray as always definitely we also give this a go because it's the perfect setting spray and it's very inexpensive as you know y'all I love my bargains and I'm not afraid to stay so I'm now eyelining my lips with a dark lip pencil and then using my sleek liquid lipstick in birthday suit just for a natural pink shade. So then I'm using this lip gloss literally from the drug from the beauty supply store. I used to wear like a similar brand when I was like 15 years old so it came back it came through and I find it's a perfect consistency because it's not too gloopy and it gives me a bit of a pink tone I'm really loving it so this is the final look you guys I hope you enjoyed it please like comment and subscribe if you did and I'll see you guys in my next video lots of love and kisses and hugs bye guys